Hey, it's Bill the Handyman up here in Northern California. How you doing today? Today we're going to talk about how to estimate repairs on appliances. So, I worked on a couple of these stoves, and particularly on these stoves, when the stove does not hold a constant temperature, it tends to rise above the normal set set temperature. And so, normally this is a um, this is a temperature control issue so basically we're looking at a thermostatically controlled temperature control so what I do is I go to searspartsdirect.com I'll go and put in the model number and then and then they'll give you a very various uh, pages you can go to for dairy for various uh, diagrams and uh, of the part you need and so basically it'll tell you a part now this particular stove we see that the part is no longer available so yeah this is showing let's see part number Anyway, that is typical, and that's why there is a market for good use secondhand appliances. Because what happens is in the industry, after about 10 years, not all the time, but after about 10 years, the numbers are all skewed, and there may be the exact same part somewhere out there, but it has a different number, and that's just to get people to buy new appliances. So that's that's why there's a market out there for secondhand appliances. Good use secondhand appliances. Um, so yeah, and what I normally do is if the client is uh, cooperative, I will have the client order the part directly from this site here and have it shipped to them and have them give me a call and let me know when it's in and then I will install it. And so thanks for watching. If you need any help you can contact me at appliance at yahoo.com 707-445-1591 Pacific Time 926. Thanks again.